He was trying to drop weight to get into the army, but a local man's extreme dieting may have been the very thing that killed him. As Channel 3's Dave Summers shows us, his mother is blaming the recruiters on the U.S. military's weight goals for its enlisted soldiers. 09 Vermillion graduate Glenn Wilsey dropped 63 pounds since December. The Lorraine County coroner says the former athlete ate less than 1,000 calories a day, used caffeine drinks and self-induced vomiting. His mother, Laura Bailey, says Glenn was following the advice of Army recruiters to meet enlistment weight requirements. This has a lot to do with making sure that people don't get hurt again. Wilsey's mother promised her interview to another media outlet, but the story is out. And a hot topic for parents fixed on spring sports. When you got guys playing professional sports that are doing steroids that are getting in the, the Hall of Fame, and uh, it's th different than when we were kids. There, there's probably a lot of pressure in sports so they can play, but nothing like that, nothing like the Army. Was it bad advice or Wilsey's own ambition that led to his death? The answer may be found in an Army investigation just ordered by the Cleveland Recruiting Battalion Commander. Lorraine County Coroner Paul Mattis says because Wilsey was an organ donor, he did not perform an autopsy on him. Dr. Mattis says Wilsey died of an irregular heartbeat brought on by extreme dieting. That opinion, Ramona, based on Wilsey's mother, what he what she had to say. Dave, what about the Army? Has it responded to the mother's accusations? Yeah, but the Recruiting Command Center has not said much, only that the matter is under investigation and expressed condolences to the family. Ramona? We'll wait to hear more. Thank you, Dave.